drought-ridden Burkina Faso, there are rumours of gold in the land and hundreds of families in need of food are involved in a desperate search for the precious metal. Tonight, RTE's Ray Kennedy reports from Kaya in Burkina Faso, where almost three million people are at risk of starvation. Digging for gold in dry soil that has for a long time stopped providing food and provides little of the precious metal they are searching for. In handmade pits, young children work alongside adults at this makeshift and dangerous gold mine near Kaya in Burkina Faso, Central Africa, where it's estimated two million people could be at risk as food supplies all but disappear in some areas. Have they food here? Okay. They don't have food to eat. Have they seen much? Okay, we don't see a lot. The extreme temperatures in this area make it difficult to work at the best of times, but since the beginning of the year, these people have been coming to this area, and as far as the eye can see, have been digging holes deep into the soil, dragging rocks up every day in the hope that there is gold. This is absolutely desperate. People have walked for hundreds of kilometres to come here, left their farms and, fam and they've brought their families here, their women and small children mining in these little holes here. Very, very dangerous. And the unfortunate thing is at the end of all this, they're going to get very little. There's very little gold here. They're, it just shows how desperate people are. In the English language, this tribe are the rain people. They've farmed this area for centuries. It's believed they can summon the rain and make the land fertile but it hasn't rained since late 2010 in any significant quantity. Now they plant fertilizer in the hope rains will return and vegetables will grow. It has not rained enough and uh, we are doing this instead to protect ourselves. When it, is, it will rain, the uh, holes will uh, keep the water and when we will put the seeds, it will uh, yield more. Eight agencies pay them to work the land. They use this to buy food today, hoping next year rain will make them into farmers again. Ray Kennedy, RTE News, Kaya, Burkina Faso.